Hi, I'm Danny O, and you're watching Cal TV. It's a beautiful day for a ball game. I'm Kevin Cohen here at Evans Diamond today as the Cal baseball team kicks off its season opener against UC Riverside in this week's edition of the Cal TV Sports Highlight. Let's see how it turns out. Kevin Miller gets off to a rocky start in the first inning, managing to load the bases as he walks Riverside's Joey Gonzalez. Riverside would capitalize on it as Michael Herr singles in Carl Yule past the diving Mark Canna to open up the game's scoring. However, after a fielder's choice scored another, Miller gets Michael Nesbitt to pop up to left field and Cal's Rich Gorman guns out Gonzalez trying to tag up at home and Cal gets out of it cheaply enough only down 2-0. In the bottom half of the first, Jeff Coburnus responds after a Dwight Tanaka double, crushing the Paul Vargas pitch to Fremont and trots home for his first home run of the season, nodding up the score at 2. Coburn has finished the game 2 for 4 with 2 RBIs. In the second, Riverside would take back the lead as second baseman Brian Horst knocks it back up the box, scoring shortstop Trevor Hairgrove. After a Michael Brady solo jet, Kevin Miller would continue to struggle in the third as Joey Gonzalez drops the hammer and takes him a yard, making the score 4-3. Miller finally settles down in the fourth inning as he strikes out the side. He would allow 4 earned runs in 5 innings. Then Cal catcher Dylan Tonneson strokes a double in the gap putting runners on second and third and setting up a scoring opportunity. Michael Brady's sacrifice fly to center would bring in a run for the Bears to tie up the score once again at 4-4. Brady finished the day with two RBIs. After Michael Herr knocked Miller out of the game with a tie-breaking two-run home run in the fifth, Rich Gorman singles to right in the seventh, starting a rally for Cal. Mark Canna brings in a run as Brett Jackson hits into a fielder's choice and Cal cuts the score 6-5. Then freshman Danny O comes in to pinch hit in a crucial situation. The first pitch from Kevin Dickey is outside. The second pitch is chased and missed, just outside again on the third pitch. O is behind on a fastball on the fourth pitch. O lays off the tough slider on the fifth pitch, setting up a full count 3-2. and two. Spots like these are what dreams are made of, and Danny O comes up clutch, smashing the hanging slider, and delivers the game-winning two-run home run over the right field fence. Man, oh man, what a way to start off his Cal baseball career with a homer in his first ever at-bat. That's all pitchers Yasser Klor and Eric Johnson needed as the Bears survived to jam in the eighth and close it out 1-2-3 in the ninth by getting the Highlanders Joey Gonzalez to ground out to second. And the Bears win 8-7. I caught up with the hero of the day, Danny O, after the game. Hi, I'm here with Danny O, the stud freshman from Mill Creek, Washington. What was going through your head when the ball cleared the fence? Um, I honestly didn't know it was going to go out or not when I hit it. You know, it, was, uh, it wasn't one of those high fly balls, it was just a line drive and then it was it cleared defense somehow and that was a home run. <laughs> and uh, what was your approach to the plate during that at bat? Um, I just wanted to get a base knock, you know, just maybe up the middle, that's what I do best, just hitting at the ball up the middle. And uh, the guy just hung a slider and I just went with it. Alright, congratulations Danny, thanks a lot. It was a great way to start off the season with the Bears winning 8-7 behind the big bat of Danny O. The winning pitcher was Yasser Klor, who's now 1-0 on the season. And the loser was Kevin Dickey of UC Riverside, who's now 0-1. Closing it out was freshman Eric Johnson for the Bears with his first save of his career. For Cal TV, I'm Kevin Cohen. Make sure you tune in next time to get your download for What's Up in Cal Athletics.